We don't want to trigger people. We don't want them to get too upset. Enter Donald Trump through the wall like the Kool-Aid man. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> is there a controversy? The bat signal is up in the night sky. The big T for Donald Trump. Somewhere, someone has said something foolish and Donald Trump must weigh in. So Donald Trump descends like the caped crusader he is into the middle of what is an irrelevant stupid fight. And he, and he jetpacks in there like the rocketeer. He says, I thought Chris was Fredo also. The truth hurts. Totally lost it. Low rating, CNN. <laughs> Okay, come on, guys. That's some funny bleep. Come on. I mean, like, I understand not Lincoln, right? Not what we get it. We get it. Okay, we get all the critiques. I get Bill Crystal ripping on him, demeaning the office of the presidency. I get all <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I get it. I, I understand. I understand. Okay. Well, I'm on the same page, guys. But come on. Okay, this is funny. If you can't appreciate the fact that a CNN anchor who calls Trump a white supremacist on a fairly regular basis is likening Fredo, the young, stupid brother from The Godfather, to the N-word, and that Donald Trump is then jumping in to be like, that's right, Fredo. Get it, Fredo? The truth hurts. Totally lost it. Low ratings. (laughs) It's like he's a bot programmed to watch a thousand hours of Trump. And then this is what the tweets come up with. At this point, I don't even know that Trump is tweeting for himself. There's a robot Trump tweeting for Trump, just taking old phrases of Trump's and then stringing them together in tweets. All the tweets are three word phrases. I just love my favorite is the tag at the end. Low ratings at CNN. Like, what does that have to do with anything? But it's the best and also the worst and the best also. It's a- <laughs> <laughs> I thought Chris was Freda also. I love that movie. That movie's great. Didn't really understand the plot to Godfather 2. And Godfather 3, why would he ditch Bridget Fonda for Sophia Coppola? Uh, for Sophia Coppola? Makes no sense. But Chris, Fredo, on the mark. <laughs> Mr. President, you're required to the Situation Room, sir. <laughs> uh, well, the good news is this means that the media will now have to declare that Fredo is in fact an ethnic slur for Italians because now Trump said it, right? So now we're just going to rewrite the whole English language because everything Trump says is an ethnic slur. Oh, my God. It's so absurd. Everything is absurd. How did we enter this reality? How do we get back to the regular reality where Mitt Romney is president since 2012? How do we how do we get back there? I don't know. But I also know it won't be nearly as entertaining. We'll get to more of this if there's more to get to, if I can handle if I can handle my bleep here. We'll get back to that in just <laughs> one second. First, we